We've got some splaining to do, you know, because we're here every week on Monday and Tuesday. We talk to you both every Monday and Tuesday. She's not here. This is the fifth time in Dancing with the Stars history, and the Eliminated Star hasn't talked to us. What happened? Why is she not here? Uh, I just think it's a lot right now. You know, Bristol's never been eliminated. We made the final last time, so it's emotional. And also, we have a crazy schedule. We've got to get to Jimmy Kimmel. We've got to fly to New York. And, um, you know, she's got to change. She's got, like, this crazy pony hairdo right now that, uh, luckily, I have no hair, so I don't have to worry about that. I just have to change my pants. So I said, you go, you go get dressed I'll go take care of this so so are you happy with how far you went yeah I mean absolutely you know make it to week four is cool in an all-star season you know I would have loved to have made it further um, you know but at the end of the day you know we did the best that we could and at least we went out on a routine where the judges said it was the best one so far rather than you could have done it better or you know and, and uh, we got the best scores we've had this season so I mean that's all I can ask for as a coach what did she privately say to you after she was eliminated you know we hugged we told each other we loved each other and that we had fun and she said at least you know it was fun I had a good time and you know it was what it was yeah. So, but now it's like the buck stops here. You've got a mortgage or you've got rent, you've got bills to pay. What are you going to do now? Do, is there a studio? Are you dancing? Are there private? Are you going to Vegas? Where are you going? Yeah, I would love to go to Vegas. Uh, unfortunately, all my friends are still here, so I'll be going alone. Uh, no, you know, for me, I, I, I keep working. I'll, I'll be here on Tuesdays. So hopefully, you'll be seeing me dance on Tuesday shows. And, um, you know, I'm in the middle of a finishing an al my first uh, full studio album. I was in Miami all summer with the Timberland camp with Wisdom and Jazzy and Jim Beans and all those guys. So I'll probably go back and you know finish up my record and then uh, I'll be here on Tuesdays. I've been talking with you about this record for a long time. It's like this dream that you are going to... meticulous as you see with my dancing. Unfortunately, I have a time limit here. On this, I don't have a time limit. So uh, you know, I'm taking my time and really you know ironing out the kinks and getting it perfect. In seasons past when I've talked to you after an elimination, there you would say to me, I knew we were going to be eliminated eliminated tonight, or I sensed we were going to be eliminated tonight. Did you feel this was your time? Uh, when I saw the bottom, the, the three left standing, yeah, I, I had a feeling. You did? Yeah, yeah. 100%. But you're okay with it. I think you, you know how to tough it is this season. The thing is that as a coach and a dancer here, you have to be okay with it. When you sign up, you sign up under the you know, assumption that you could be eliminated. Same thing if you're a UFC fighter. You sign up knowing you're going to get knocked out, maybe. You know what I mean? So... You have to ha always have that in the back of your mind, and every Tuesday, I, Derek says it the best, you know, I pre prepare my partner for the worst, and if you make it through and you come out on top, that's, that's a bonus, and then if you don't, you are prepared. I won't ask you to pick a winner, I will ask you to pick the final two. Um, if I had to pick a winner and put my money where my mouth is, this could be, on, this could be loyalty speaking, but I'll probably go with Sean and Derek. And who will they be up against? Uh, I can give you a top four. I can't call it two right now. If I was to give you the semifinal into the final, I would be pegging it as Gilles, Sean, Kelly, and Sabrina or Melissa, I think. So Sean and Gilles went at it once before with Sean winning. So this could be deja vu. Round two, baby. Round two.